All right, so how do you take a simple 2D image, add in 3D objects and still have shadows on it? Let's go. All right, so this is something that's really simple, but I couldn't find an updated tutorial for this. I have this image. I want this to be the background image. Well, all you really need to do is just come over here on the shading editor, switch this to world, press control T on this if you have Node Wrangler. Node Wrangler is an add-on, by the way. I highly recommend it. And just get rid of this, add in an image texture. Let's just connect both of these and use that. Come over here and switch this from window to vector. Next step, what you want to do is you want to come to the output properties, change the resolution to match the image. So 5125 and 6406. Uh, you can change the resolution percentage over here to control how big or small you want your image to be. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So like 1% press F12 and it's rendered. Yay. Anyway, that's not the point. I'm going to keep it at 50% for now. Add a plane, scale it up, scale it along the Y axis over here as well, just so I can match it with the road. So what you do now is you just move the camera up and down and sort of try to match the image. As soon as you're happy with the results, just add in a light source to sort of match the image as well. So I'm just going to add in a sun over here and point it this way just to match these rays. And that looks fine. Maybe increase the angle to make the shadow less dense. And I'm also going to just increase the strength. Select the plane, come to objects, visibility, and turn it into a shadow catcher. And there you go.